What's going on everyone? Welcome back. Today I will be showing you the seven exercises that you must add to your workout routines either in the beginning, the middle, or the end of your sessions. Doing these workouts that I will go over is meant to improve and strengthen your body's natural movements. The reason why these are important is because every day we sit down, we stand up, we move left, we move right, we move forward, and we move back. Again, doing these things with improper form can later down the line cause nagging injuries, nagging issues that some of you may have now, right? Back, my back hurts, or just from sitting down, or my neck hurts, and it's just simple movements that you are doing with improper form. The goal is to train for longevity and not insanity. So make sure you guys stay all the way to the end of the video to see the number one most beneficial exercise that you can do for your body's natural movements. But before you do that, you already know, I need you guys to slam that subscribe button so I can continue to make more content for you guys. Let's hop into it. Workout number one, deadlifts. Deadlifts are one of the best exercises that you can do because it pretty much works almost every muscle in the human body. The reason they are called deadlifts because it requires you to pick dead weight off of the floor. Now think about that as we go throughout our daily lifestyle. How many times do you have to pick up something off of the floor? And how many times are you doing it improperly? By rounding your back, pulling from your back, and not pulling from the proper areas. This exercise is really good for pretty much anybody, but really good for nurses, firefighters, caregivers, you know, construction workers, etc. Pretty much everybody. Adding deadlifts to your workouts can help improve your overall body strength. Also help strengthen your core, your legs, your glutes, your back, and also improve your posture. So make sure you guys add deadlifts to your routines. Number two, push-ups. One of my favorites. Push-ups is one of the best overall exercises that you could do for your body. Adding push-ups to your routine can help strengthen your triceps, your chest, your back, your core, improve your posture, and also help with core stabilization. Adding push-ups to your routine can help you with anything pushing or pressing throughout your daily life. So if you had to think about all the things that you do every day, does it require pushing? Does it require pressing? If so, you wanna make sure you add some push-ups into your routine. Here are a few variations of push-ups that you can try, whether you're a beginner, moderate, or advanced. Modified. Close grip, wide grip, neutral grip. I recommend you giving all of these routines a try until you get better. Number three, pull-ups. Pull-ups are one of the most challenging, but one of the most beneficial out of all of these exercises. Pull-ups may not play a major role with your daily activities, but they help strengthen the muscles that you will need in order to do these daily activities. So make sure you add pull-ups into your routine as they will help strengthen your back, they will help strengthen your shoulders, pretty much everything. These are one of the hardest exercises that you could do, but as I explained before, it's one of the most beneficial. So make sure you guys add pull-ups into your routine. Number four, overhead press. This exercise has variations of different names such as military press or a strict press. This exercise involves you extending your arms with weight over your head. So you can do this with either a barbell, a kettlebell, or a dumbbell. Throughout the day, you'll be surprised on how many times you actually reach over your head to grab something, whether it's on top of a fridge, whether pulling something from a cabinet, as doing overhead press will help strengthen those easy movements that you perform over and over throughout your life. Number five, loaded carries. Loaded carries are any exercise that requires you to walk and carry weight. Exercises such as farmer carries can help you with any demand where you have to transport weight from one place to another. Now you can do this with either dumbbells, kettlebells, water jugs, whatever it may be. The benefits of loaded carries help you improve your grip strength, your upper body strength, your core stabilization, and also help you with groceries if you gotta carry laundry throughout the day, things like that. So make sure you guys add some farmer's carries, suitcase carries, routines into your workouts. Number six, lunges. Lunges are one of the best exercises that you can do for your legs. As every day we walk, step on platforms, and just performing movements with single leg actions. So doing lunges will help improve the strength in your legs in regards to ankle stabilization, strengthening your glutes, strengthening your quads. I recommend starting with body weight, 
working your way towards dumbbells, and then progressing to a barbell lunge. Number seven, squats. This is by far the number one exercise that you can do for your body's natural overall movements. Squatting is an exercise that we perform every day without even thinking. Every day we stand up and sit down. But doing this with improper form can later down the line, as some of you may have, nagging issues with low back, create poor posture, etc. When performing squats correctly, this will help improve your strength in your glutes, your quads, your hamstrings, help with ankle, st ankle stability, and also improve your posture as well if doing them correctly. If you are unsure how to squat, make sure you click the video in the top right corner, whatever side that may be, <laughs> as I have a full explanation on exactly how to do a squat from beginners. As you guys have seen, these are the seven most beneficial exercises that you can do to help with any nagging issues or nagging injuries that you may have. So again, make sure you add some of these workouts into your routine. Again, it doesn't matter if it's body weight and you can work your way up, right? It's not a race against anybody, it's a race against yourself. So work on your posture, work on your strength, and get rid of those nagging issues that you got within your body. If you guys will want more detailed instructions on how to do any of these workouts, I need you to hit that subscribe button. And also, like the video as I can create more content for you. Peace and love, you know the vibes, I'm out.